they want us to write the equation of a quadratic with the vertex of 2, 3 containing the point 0, 2. So we'll remember our vertex form equation of a quadratic. And there it is. Remember this is hk is your vertex, so hk, h is 2, k is 3. Now I also have x and y for a specific point, so x is 0, y is 2, and now I can solve for a. Remember with this equation we want that, that, and that to be filled in with numbers. We don't want x and y to be numbers in our final equation because that's what makes it an equation, having a dependent, a dependent and an independent variable. So when I solve this, negative 2 squared is 4, so that's 4a plus 3 equals 2. Subtract 3 from both sides, you get negative 1 equals 4a. Divide both sides by 4, you get a equals negative 1 fourth. Now I rewrite the equation, filling in for a, h, and k. y equals negative 1 fourth, which is a, times x minus 2, which is h squared, plus 3, which is k. There's your answer. One little thing to remind you of, if this number right here was negative, that would mean that this would be a plus because a minus a negative is a positive. So that kind of tricks people sometimes. But there's your answer.